Florentino Perez claims Sergio Ramos stalled on new Real Madrid contract. Real Madrid president Florentino Perez has confessed he gave Sergio Ramos the chance to sign a new contract but was forced to withdraw from talks after he didn't get an answer. Ramos controversially walked away from Real this summer after 16 years at the club, having pushed for a two-year contract that was not forthcoming. Real wanted Ramos to stay, but were only prepared to offer him a one-year contract, which Ramos revealed he eventually tried to accept, but was told that he had taken too long and the offer had been withdrawn. Perez was pressed on the matter during a recent interview with Onda Ciro's El Transistor, and although he did his best to avoid talking about it, he did admit that he did try and keep Ramos but had no choice but to move on. I had a tough time at Sergio Ramos's farewell event. I love Sergio Ramos like a son, Perez admitted. I wasn't with him at the farewell press conference because I've never been to a press conference with any player. I have an adoration for Sergio Ramos and I'm not going to talk about the bickering. He is a legend at Real Madrid and that's what we Real Madrid fans are left with. We offered him a contract, we gave him a deadline and he didn't accept it. He was thinking about other things and life goes on. He will do very well for sure and this is his home. I would be delighted if Sergio Ramos went to a club that offered him what we have not been able to offer him. Perez also confessed that he has not read Zinedine Zidane's open letter to the fans explaining his departure from the Santiago Bernabeu, admitting he does not want to hear just how frustrated the former manager was. I knew Zidane leaving was a possibility because it had been a tough year, he said. I spent a whole afternoon trying to convince him to stay, but when Zidane wants to go, he has already left. They have told me that the letter is not good, I do not want to read it. The one who wrote that letter has told me that it was not Zidane. I have known him since 2001 and I wish him the best. I am sure he will get to be Fran's coach.